my favorite sets. Ooh, what is this? Is this, um... Hmm, all right, it's a tag team. Let's see it. Oh, yes. What's up, YouTube? It's Awana Turtle, and today we are finishing up our Full Metal Wall Japanese booster box opening. Uh, before we jump into that, I want to just show off some cool uh, pro Japanese promos that I obtained recently. So this is from a seven-card series called Pretend Boss Pikachu. Um, so let's see. I think this is he's dressed up as Maxi, and then Cyrus. This one's my favorite one. Uh, Guzma, Lysander, and then I think this guy's name is this or something um, there's two more that, that I don't have I think one is uh, aqua's Archie and team rockets like Giovanni um, but these are all PS10 so there's only two left I need to obtain and yeah guys keep keep an eye on that subscribe count uh, when we hit that uh, third triple digits um, you know what that means and if you don't already know uh, just check my previous videos all right guys full metal wall let's do this all right guys, let's do this full metal wall. We got 15 more packs to wrap up this opening. I have to say for my first, um, you know, normal Japanese box opening, this has been very enjoyable and, and I think pretty well received. So thanks for all the support and we'll definitely continue to do these kind of things in the future. However, I still don't know how to open these. Okay, so for our first pack, we have, I think his name is Moly and this card's pretty bad. The Hitmon top in the city again, well, the Meltan, and kind of uh, fitting. We have the Mel Metal boxes in the background. That Squirtle again, I really like, and then a Kartana for our first pack. Ooh, there we go. We're figuring it out, guys. All right, as usual, guys, if you do enjoy this video and you want to see more of these Japanese box opens, let me know by hitting that like button um, and let me know in the comments below. As always, if you're looking for some code cards, let me know. Even though this is a Japanese opening and I'm not, there's no code cards in the video, just let me know in the comment and I'll hook you up. This is the four metal Pokemon. If you attach this to it, it's uh, you subtract like 70 damage from attacks, which is pretty good. Uh, we got a Metapod, Zubat, Sandshrew, and then Sand Slash. So it's kind of interesting. If you don't get a Hollow, you just get an Uncommon. You don't. There's so it seems like there's no regular rares, which I guess I don't have a big problem with. It's just kind of strange, I guess. So I feel like compared to the English set, the uh, Hollows in Japanese are make up the regular rares. So we see something shiny in the background. We got Ekans. The sea cucumber thing? I'm still not sure. If you know who this is, what the Pokemon's called, let me know in the comments. Ooh, okay. We got a Lucario, but we are looking for his buddy. I think that's definitely the the tag team card that we want the most. That'd be great if that could be our secret secret rare of the box. I think there's almost always at least one in these Japanese boxes. If I could pick another one I think the buzzwall or maybe the blue search I think is kind of cool too Santru and then Agron all right and keep it on that sub sub count guys for the channel uh, after we hit 100 we're gonna do that giveaway giving away a pack of ultra shiny and if you're not familiar with that set check the video where it says I think it says something like giveaway announced and at the end of it I have a little segment about all the cards some of the great cards you can get from that set I think it's one of my favorite sets Ooh, what is this is this um hmm all right it's a tag team let's see it oh yes we got the Lucario Mel metal tag team the for two for DCE uh, we have Steel Fist, um, and that does Searcher Deck for Metal Energy attached to this Pokemon, and then for Heavy Impact 2 Metal, uh, 
two double colorless, uh, it's just 150, but then it's full metal wall. Until the end of the game, so this continues, your metal Pokemon take 30 less damage from opponent's attacks. If this has one extra energy attached to it, um, discard all energy from your opponent's active Pokemon. So like it doesn't do any damage, but it, it I feel like if you pull this off in the very beginning, that's very strong. So really happy with that hit. That's definitely the one I was looking for. So that still means that all right, I'm really happy with that. We got one of the cards we definitely want. We actually, we got both of the the tag teams that I really wanted, and we still have a secret rare. So who knows? Maybe that means we'll get another one to get that secret rare version of it. All right, next pack we have a Sand Slash War Turtle, Spiro, Go Bat by the Fountains, and then that Metal Armor thing again. Don't want a. Uh, I think there's an ultra rare version of that card. So that that doesn't excite me that much. All right, that Moly guy again. Something shiny in the back. Meltan, Squirtle, hit him on top again and. All right, not sure who this supporter is or trainer. Sand True, Caterpie, something shiny in the back again. Laron, and then a Crobat. We pulled this guy last time. Two Crobats in one box. Can't say I'm too happy about that. So, Double Blaze. I think it's called Double Blaze or Double Fire. Uh, is officially out in Japan. And I have purchased some. So, however, it does take a while for it to get to to the states um however i think uh the order got updated to ship so uh, maybe in the next month or so we can do the next set and that should be everything from this set uh we didn't do any night unison um but then plus double blaze should be everything that makes up unbroken bonds in the next english set i do like that Firo art excited about that one Firo is like from he's like a very OG guy, but I feel compared to Pidgey wasn't as popular. Pidgey had two two evolutions compared to Spiro just had one. So and we got the Golbat and then ooh <laughs> Mel Metal. So we got the Lucario, the Mel Metal, and then them together as the tag team. So I, I'm very happy with the results of this box. I have to say, as as long as we get a secret rare um, that is uh, not terrible. Then I'll be very happy, very content with the results of this box. So we got the Zoo Bat again, the Metapod. We're starting to; these things are starting to repeat. Or as far as the um, commons and uncommons, I think we've seen them all for the most part. If anything, that means that we can just kind of pick up the pace. All right, Blue Search, Firo, that cucumber thing again, Tangela, and ooh. As far as getting a dupe, I don't mind this one. This, this card is really funny. Uh, again, if you missed it last time, so this attack for uh, one water energy, then two colorless is X100. So you flip three coins in each head so that does 100 damage, but if you get all three tails, you lose the game instantly. I find that very funny. All right, let's keep going. We got three packs left. For this opening of Full Metal Wall, I also kind of like the the boxes that these things come in. Uh, I feel like it's more compact. Although I, I guess compared to the English sets or the English packs, there where they have ten cards, this one only has half the amount. Uh, maybe that's why. But I do I do like the boxes. So and we have the Genesect skydiving. Uh, I feel like it feels very uh, like military commando, and he's just kind of skydiving into like the battlefield or something. All right, two packs left, everyone. Let's see if we can't. We should. I'm pretty sure that we we haven't pulled a secret rare yet, so I think we should have one more card. This looks like a regular hollow. In oh, it is another GX. So we did pull a this Blastoise last time in the full art variety. Hope that full art doesn't count as our secret rare. And so we'll put this off to next to the Mel Metal Bukara. So last pack, I'm hoping this has some kind of hyper rare, secret rare variant of something and that the full art didn't count as that. Um, that actually be pretty disappointing. Because other than that, this has been a great box. So for our last pack, we have a Butterfree, Graveler, Meltan, Ekans, and then a Boring Cat. Hmm, all right, so the good news is we pulled two more GX and we got that tag team that I definitely wanted to pull. The bad news is no no secret rare or anything. 
uh, unless the full art counts as one, but I, I'm not sure. Um, so mixed feelings, but uh, if you did enjoy the video, again, hit that like button. If you're new, hit subscribe, and if you, when you see it hit uh, triple digits, um, stay tuned for that, that giveaway um, video. On that, thanks for watching, guys. I'm Moana Turtle, and I'll catch you guys next time. Peace.